So the final race of the week then is over in Kyoto. It's a one mile seven foot on group one. And it's for three year olds. And at the top we've got Caribus for Dan Hughes, Johnny Cash, Leon Van Rensburg, Chickasaw Nova, Vinnie Gerard, Electric Ember for Munas, Running Chi for David Robertson, Trapanga Zagala for Darren Thompson, and Unchained Melody for Professor Rhodes. Just seven then in this the oddly distanced group one race, one mile and seven furlongs. We do have quite a few one mile seven furlong races in France as well. And then away and racing. Running Chi was a little bit slow out. Caribus was the other one that didn't get out all that quickly. But now the grey electric ember looks like it's going to dispute the lead with the other grey. Took us all over in between the two of them. Johnny Cash. So Johnny Cash then has gone off into the lead. Leading by about two lengths as they pass the crowd with a complete circuit of the Kyoto track to go. And Johnny Cash leading by a couple of lengths then to... Caribus, who's closest to us in the blue and the yellow jacket of Unchained Melody. The black with the yellow the square thing is Electric Ember. And you've got Running Chi in the pink and the turquoise stripes. With the second of the greys, the two shades of green for Chickasaw Nova. And then finally the back marker is Trapanga Zagala in Darren Thompson's maroon with the white sleeves. Head towards the back stretch, and it's Johnny Cash leading by three to Caribus in second. Then on chain, Melody Electric Ember with Running Chi and Chickasaw Nova, and finally Trapanga Zigala just to bring it up the rear at the moment. And heading into the final mile now, then. Johnny Cash is an undisputed lead all the way. Caribus is in second. Unchained Melody back in third. Would have not been changing all that much, to be honest. Although Chickas all over has just been relegated to the back. Johnny Cash continues to lead. A good four clear of Caribus. What is making a good but a ground up now is Trapanga Zagala. That one's moved into a share of third with a great electric ember. And if I've just gone past him now, one chain melodies that would have just dropped back a little bit and running cheese now the back marker. But it's Johnny Cash who's still in the lead, but only by two and a half to Caribus and Trapanga Zagala, who now share second. Then comes Electric Ember back in fourth. Chickasaw Nova is getting closer on the outside in fifth. Unchained Melody has just lost its place and the back marker is running chi. They've got three and a half to go and they're all being scrubbed along a little bit now as they try and get themselves into the position they want to be in when they come off the bottom turn and into the straight and it's Johnny Cash who continues to lead but by about two lengths to Chickasaw Nova who's now come through into second. Unche Melody's been switched to the outside and he's now running on to Panga Zagala and Caribas just hit a bit of a flat spot running Chi is now trying to get into it as well and Electric Ember looks the first one beaten but it's Johnny Cash in the lead they've only got a furlong to go and Johnny Cash is hanging on from Chickasaw Nova who's starting to close. Chickasaw Nova beginning to get up closest to us. Could this be another big race win for Vinny Gerard? It's Chick Chickasaw Nova forges into the lead and Chickasaw Nova's going to take it. Chickasaw Nova wins it from Johnny Cash, second Caribus, third on chain, Melody Trapanga Zagala flooded to deceive, then running Chi and finally Electric Ember. But it's yet another big race win for Vinnie Gerard. That's what I won pretty cleverly in the end. Johnny Cash led all the way, did all the donkey work and got picked off in the final quarter furlong. And the final race of the week goes the way of the majority of them. Chickasaw Nova to Vinnie Gerard then. Johnny Cash second for Leon Van Rensburg. Caribus third for Dan Hughes. Unchained Melody for Paul Edwards fourth. And Trapanga Zagala for Darren Thompson was fifth.